everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today is part two of my fall clean and decorate with me. You can see all of this stuff is behind us. We are going to focus on today. I'm going to do a tablescape for you guys, a cute fall tablescape. And then we're also going to do the kitchen as well. Um, I'm going to try to keep things a little bit more minimal than I've done in the past but it's still gonna be all zhuzhed up for fall. So I hope you guys thoroughly enjoy this video and let's get started. Let's start on that tablescape. So we're going to start with the centerpiece. I'm going to use this um, little charger that I've had for quite some time. I am all in with mixing all different shades of wood. That's where I kind of get my color from. So my table is actually oak, but I'm going to use this kind of unfinished, distressed, it has little feet on the bottom, charger in the middle. I think it looks cute there. I have this picture from Hobby Lobby. I'm horrible. I keep all of the tags on everything. It was only $17.99. Not sure the price of this thing because I've had it forever. But I'm going to put that in the middle. I'm going to kind of style it from the front, but it needs to look good all around. I have these florals. They are a mix of the little pumpkins are from Albertsons back in California. Um, these are from Michaels and the rest of the florals are from Walmart, which they have really good prices on florals. So I like the neutral tones of everything. So I'm gonna put this together. And the, white, the mouth of this pitcher is really big, so you need kind of a lot of flowers to fill it, fill it in. And I like the look. I like the look. I'm horrible. I don't even take off the tags. Like, girl, bye. <laughs> Super cute. We're going to go with that. I have these two pumpkins from Big Lots. You cut off the tag. This one, $4. This one was. I love this fuzzy one. And I'm just gonna kind of set it up. That back on here. I could be wrapped around your arms instead of being Guys, I think I like the vibe. The case and not the stars, but no You're behind. I'm gonna bring you guys up front. Let's check it out. So I think I love that vibe. I love it, love it, love it. And then it looks so pretty. Okay guys, we're gonna work on a place setting. I'm just gonna do two at each end. So these come in a pack of four. These are from Hobby Lobby. So put one there, there and one here. It should have been. These, um, I got two sets. They are from Wayfair. I love them. I use them for so many holidays. So one there and one on this end. We still have four seats to eat at each day. And these are going to be super duper easy. You can even push them in the 
the middle. These are napkins. I love the little fringing on the end. They come in a pack of four for like, I want to say like $6.99. They are from Hearth and Hannah at Target. These gorgeous bowls, they were $4.99 a piece. And they are, look at the pumpkins around them. They are from Home Goods. Those here. Super juicy, super easy in the middle. I'm just gonna add this orange pumpkin. And, and y'all, I want to do a dance. I'm finally. Three years later, <laughs> I'm finally using these uh, the candle holders, but I think they look great with the candles from Michaels. I was just meant to do them in this house, that's why I never use them. But these are hearth and hand candles, are the cream color, and these are from uh, Michaels. Like I Guys, I think it looks so good. And of course, when I burn this candle, I'm gonna pull it away, but oh, I think it looks so pretty and so cozy and so warm. I love it. And you could even do the runner if you want, but I think I like it without the runner. We're gonna see how I like it without the runner. If I feel like I need it, I'll add it in, but I love it so much. So over here, I have these two, and I think they need some pops of orange. So let's add that in there. The same bundle from Walmart. I think they look so cute. These tins are from Walmart a few years back. And then I have just greenery. I think it's all from Walmart. But I love them. They look so cute. Wooden spoons. 
little sign. Okay. This is how this little corner is looking. This is my little marble um, paper towel holder from Hearth and not Hearth in Hand, Home Goods. It was only like $7.99, but I think I like very simple, easy what's going on over there. The cutting board. Cover up that little echo. There. That's good. And then our little, this is from Hearth and Hand. And I think that's simple and it's super cute. I'm going to put my little wax warmer. So very simple, but I think I love it. Okay. And on the stove, we're just going to add back that. I think that is cute and good. Very simple, good. I still need to find a tea towel. I'm thinking something that's orange that'll have a pop of color, but I like it so far. Let's add back this, and then this is the cookbook, and then we're going to put it on a chili recipe that we're going to make. And there you go. Nice, cozy, and simple. Let's add in this board. This is from the Target dollar spot. I could be driving to your place, but now the crown is shaking. Could be a face, but it feels like it will never go away. Until we make up, I can't be myself. This is the same mug spread. Container. This container is from the um, Target. And then I have, I love this so much. This room spray. And then this is It's a salt candle, just perfect for the kitchen. Guys, we are done with the kitchen. I just added a simple one of my great pumpkins to the back end of this. I think that looks cute and put together. I could even take off the room spray to give it more room, but everything fits to my liking. Um, the island is clear. And then here we just have it really simple. Our hearth and hand tray for our baked goods. We have the um, tray in the back that we can use for charcuterie boards, different stuff, but it looks cute. The pumpkin tray, our little wax warmer here, cookbook, really simple, just a spoon rest there, a marbled one that's from Home Goods. And then here, just very simple, we just added in the fall in love sign and then the wooden pumpkin in the back and I just think those wooden rich tones just scream fall. So very simple in the kitchen but I love it and it is functional and beautiful. So that is it folks. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Sorry um, the <laughs> 
there is uh, mowing in the background, but what are you going to do? But I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I will have a part three of clean and decorate with me. In that video, we're going to be tackling the upstairs playroom and then I will do a whole house tour because I am just bound to change things around. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you very soon. Bye guys.